Oh my god, dude. Got like some crazy arm blades. He's gonna pop up. There he is. He's popping up, god damn it. Get the fuck out of here. It's like I'm in a damn Terminator movie. God. Can you keep the car still for a little bit? Just just a little bit. Keep the car. Okay. If you can keep the car, never mind. You know, you take care of it. It's fine. Guy's ah, still alive trying to move. Don't you dare faint again. Keep your eyes open. Fuck. We both could use medical attention. Do you know a Repadoc whom you can trust? We got yeah, we gotta go to uh, Corpo. I've seen them before. Troy. The exterminators. We must get to Repadoc quickly. Well, let's compliment him first. Well back there. Do not waste time. <laughs> I'm trying to compliment Victor you. Will fix us up. We have to get there somehow. Call someone. Anyone. Oh, we just we have the like car. We can call the AI car. Why, Why not just cut me loose? I'm a dead weight to you. Make the call. All right, all right. Greetings. My scanner indicates you are outside the surface area. Come pick me up. Need to get to Misty's Esoterica. In front of Vix. Of course. A vehicle is en route. It should arrive in less than 20 minutes. What are you doing? Hey! Uh, I'm passing out for 20 minutes so I don't have to wait. What does it look like? That's what I'm doing. I don't feel like sitting here waiting, so I'm just going to pass out until the car gets here. The personal link is damaged. Please proceed to insert the jack below the ear, though not too deep. There should be auxiliary neuro sockets between his lymph nodes, beneath the SCM muscle. If I hit the vein by mistake, he will die. Indeed, as he will if you do nothing. I think I have the socket. Now proceed to connect. Let's get him inside. I cannot hold it. I need to rest. That your blood? Misty! Well, at least we made it. So Press that's attack. promising. It's neurogenic shock. Dying. Gotta cut my way through the occipital bone. No other way. There is risk of. I know what I'm doing. Yeah, I get to like see for two seconds and then it's like back to black. <laughs> we can't see anything. I guess we're like phasing in and out of consciousness. Stand up. Stand up, damn it. Stand the fuck up. 
What is he even looking at over there? It's just like he's looking at like a wallpaper, like a desktop wallpaper. He's like just zoning out, How looking at his he? computer. Slower on the men than you, but looking better every day. Feel like shit. Fuck. I don't know, Vic. Ears are ringing. And I'm seeing shit. These hallucinations. Describe them to me. Blinding lights. It's loud. I'm on stage and I almost can't breathe. I'm so damn full of hatred. And then I let it all out into a mic. And I realized it didn't help. I don't feel any better. And then, <laughs> promise not to laugh. I plant a bomb in Arasaka Tower. Nothing there to laugh about. Night City looked different, strange. And I hated it. Hated everybody, every inch. It's too real, even for a lucid dream. You weren't dreaming, V. Those were memories. There's a personality construct on that shard. Dreams you had were from his past. Saying I experienced another psyche's memories? How's that possible? You two are connected in a way I can't make head or tail of. Two? Me and who, Vic? <laughs> Who's the other? Johnny Silverhand, the terrorist. Real talk of the town back in my day. <sighs> anyway, that's not what's important right now. What is? The biochip. It's basically a bomb. Fuse lit already. You don't have much time left. Much life. A few weeks tops. Silverhand's construct is overriding your consciousness, gradually taking over your body until one day you'll just be gone. V, it's important you get all this. Fix me up, right? Vic? If I could, I would be. Believe me. But this is... It's way beyond what I know how to do. You're the best of the best, Vic. Why can't you help me? You want the long story or the short? Don't admit a thing. Not one deep. Okay, there was, is, a construct, a psyche on the chip, that of Johnny Silverhand. You jacked it in your chip slot. Nothing happened, right? Until you died. Bullet in the head from Dexter to Sean. But how do you come back from something like that? Low caliber, you lucked out. Not least thanks to another poor decision by Mr. Deshaun. The nanites off the chip started fixing the damage. Then they took your hand and coaxed you off the path toward the light. People don't just die and get up like nothing happened. Used to be true. Now it's only if they don't have a classified piece of corpo tech primed to resurrect them. What about me? My psyche? I'll make it back from the other side and what? I'm supposed to pretend change is normal? Ask the Arasaka engineers who built the thing. All I know is, your mind's gonna go. It won't be pretty. 
From the biochip's perspective, your brain cells are a tumor that needs to be scooped out, while your body's an empty shell to hold the construct. So this fucking terrorist wants to wipe me and take my place, take my body. It's not willful on his part, it's automatic, inevitable, and neither of you can stop it. Can't we just take the chip out? Or switch it off? Either way is out of the question. You die immediately. Vic, you've always come through for me. If there's nothing you can do to help me, then... Well, what the hell do I do? Tell me, please. Vic. I wish I knew, kid. Misty? You're asking too much from an old-timer like Vic. Come on, V. Let's get you home. Wow, I, what, what a, like, wild change of events from how things were going. I don't know. Never expected that. That's some pretty heavy stuff. I don't know. I don't know how this is all gonna work out. We're either just gonna, gonna die. fade away or find someone I better. I was gonna die with him in my sleep. Sleep's a small hint of death, the inevitable. Can't actually tell if I'm awake now. I mean, I could be dead already, right? Not something to focus on, V. Let it go. Here, got some meds for you. Omega blockers. Taken regularly, they'll keep things from progressing too quickly. Also, they should keep that guest of yours calm and quiet. Pseudoendotrizine's from me. Effect will be opposite. It'll speed things up. Free the demon, so to speak. Giving me a pill to prod that son of a bitch so he can kill me faster? Listen, you're likely to be fine for a while. But sometime down the road, it could turn into pure agony. I'm giving you options, honey. The brain can be tricked. Plain old painkillers do that. Your psyche's gonna die, V. You'll feel your old self slipping away. At some point, you won't recognize yourself. It'll be terrifying. It'll be painful. But it doesn't have to be. The fuck I need pills for? Ought to just stick a gun in my mouth and pull the trigger. Well, that way you'd kill two souls. Is that what you want? I gotta lie down. Here. Got one more thing for you. Look, I just wanted to lay down. Now you're in the way on the bed. Vic pulled this out of your skull. A lucky charm? Yeah, what the hell's that? I promise you'll try to get some sleep. Didn't you hear? My condition's terminal. What good can this do? Don't be silly. As long as you're alive, there's hope. And don't let anyone tell you otherwise. I really think I can make it. Survive this? Of course you can. I mean, you did already die and come back once, didn't you? Misty, wait. Uh, about Jackie. Yeah? I'm so fucking sorry Jack's not here anymore. Jackie was special. Really spiritually rich. He touched so many people with his love. Don't worry. He'll be around. You sure you'll be all right? I'll be fine. Life is so beautifully powerful. So much more powerful than death. But right now, you need rest. So sleep. Please sleep. 
All right, time to sleep. As we'll just lean back and get some sleep, you know, sleep a couple weeks and then just lose our mind. I don't know what the, this thing has to be important. This thing has to be like something at some point. I don't know, dude. Things have gotten wild. I thought we were just going to keep, like, cruising along and just doing random missions and stuff, but that things things got turned upside down real fucking quick. Holy crap. Oh, God, Johnny's here. Out of here understand? We will become the Silver Hand. Oh, shit. You Dude, Keanu is, like, he's real aggressive. I don't know. I didn't think Keanu was this aggressive. Need a smoke. Where'd you stash yours? Yeah, I guess he's just gonna bang his head on the wall a little bit. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get really good sleep with uh, old Johnny here waking me up constantly. Don't smoke. Then go out and get some. Just need one last one. Jesus fucking Christ, man. The fuck kind of joint toy are you supposed to be? Fucking ghost off! Hey, can I talk to him anymore? Maybe not. Do I have any cigarettes for Keanu? Keanu wants cigarettes. Oh, God, he teleported in front of me. He pushed me. Who you work for? Start talking. Fuck. Fucking chip. Rip the thing out myself. No, wait. Oh. Hallucinating and dreaming, or I don't know, I'll reality. Control. Oh, God. Find a way. He's gonna like try to break out of the window. You hear me? Ah, this is kind of scary. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what the hell's happening. See you never, asshole. Yeah, let's take some of these meds. No, like that. Oh, come on, Johnny, my blue pills. Johnny, why'd you slap me? Keanu, come on. I can feel it. Our minds touch on you. I'm like mold on fruit creeping into you. Nothing I can do about it. You hear me? I'd puke if I fucking could. It's just a copy of the engram. I'm out there somewhere. Gotta be. Leave me alone. Get out. Just get the fuck out. Hear me, asshole? A bullet to the fucking brain! Take these meds, get Keanu out of here. We need a break from Keanu for a little bit. Oh, fuck me. We need a show. I never thought I would say this, but we need a we need a bit of a break from Keanu. Keanu's gotta take a break here. Oh, we're in Act 2 now. Nice. Good old Act 2. Holy shit, dude. What a long, like... Can I get my pills? No. How many pills did I take? They're, like, all gone. <laughs> I take that many pills. Good lord, dude. That took, like... That was so long. So much stuff happened there, and that took just so freaking long. My god. So we got stock up on ammo. We got, like, a whole bunch of other stuff. We'll probably do some. Open your inventory. Put clothes on. Find something to eat. Dude, we, we get to do some, like, regular, like, living and stuff. But I don't know. That That's a lot to unpack. The, a lot. Jackie's dead, apparently. We got scammed and fucked over by Dexter. I don't know what would have happened if we sided with, what was her name, Evelyn? 
I don't know what would have maybe Jackie would still be alive. I'm sure like stuff like this would have still happened. I don't I don't know how it would have happened, but it probably would have been different. Like now we've got Keanu in our head. I don't know how much time has passed. Now we just have to like check our email and shit. Ah, what a, what a wild recording session today. That was uh That was pretty pretty crazy. I I definitely didn't expect that. <laughs> I didn't expect things to go this way, but I guess I've stocked up on some ammo. I don't know if there's like anything else in here, but stocked up on some stuff. When we come back next time, we'll do some of these other quests, missions, whatever little little segments. We'll check our email, we'll get something to eat, we'll whatever else we need to do. But that's going to be for next time. There's a lot to unpack here and I don't know. I it would be nice to take a little bit of a break and hopefully come back next time a little bit more refreshed. But holy shit, what what a change of events and what what a different direction the game has started to go. And so we'll we'll see how things continue to progress when we come back next time. Hope you enjoyed the videos. I'll see you guys then.